Good morning, everybody. Today we're gonna work on week three handwriting. So I need for you to make sure that you get the week three assignment sheet and your handwriting paper. And remember that with the handwriting paper, the margin should be going down the left side of the paper. You're only going to write on the line with the dashes, okay? These are spaces, so don't write on those. And watch those lines very carefully. This week, under practice, the number one says to draw two lines of short overstrokes and two lines of tall overstrokes. This is a review. So with short over, you're gonna start at the bottom line and you curve up to the middle line. And we're gonna do two lines of those. Tall over starts at the bottom line and it's a curve up and to the top line and you'll do two complete lines of that. Number two says to draw two lines of short under and two lines of tall under. Again, this is a review. Under, under, under. Two lines of that, tall under. Under, under, under. And do two lines of those. You are practicing four lowercase letters the first one is the lowercase a. It starts at the middle line where you see those dashes and you're gonna come around. It's almost like making an oval, like a, an egg on, this, on its side. Then do a short slant down and a short under. Again, around and under. And you'll do two lines of a. A c also starts at the middle line. I drop down. I come around and do an understroke. So this is a C. C does not start at the bottom line. Do two lines of C. A D is like an A, but when you come around, you come all the way back up to the top line, do a tall slant down, short under. So this is a D. And you're gonna do two lines of D. An O starts at the middle line, you come around, and you end at the middle line. Again, O does not start at the bottom line. You will do two lines of O. With these letters, we are practicing four words. The words are cope, C, O, P, E. Now notice, because O ends at the middle line, you come out and then drop into your P. You'll do, excuse me, you're gonna do two lines of cope. Then you have latch, which is L, A, T, C, H. You'll do two lines of latch. Remember an L is a tall letter, T is a tall letter, H is a tall letter. So they should fill the line. Duck starts at the middle line, D, U, C, K, and we're gonna do two lines of that. Remember, this is the U, it does not end at the middle line, this is your beginning stroke going into your C. And finally, the word deep is D, E, E, P. Notice all of my letters, all of my words end at the middle line. Do two lines of D, of, of deep. So let's count two, four, six, eight, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24. You will fill both sides of the handwriting paper this week, okay? So this is your handwriting assignment for week three. It's due next week. I hope this helps you to make sure that you're doing everything correctly. Have a great day.